All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to clean a muddy four-wheeler. Um, first things first, you need a pressure washer. You don't need one, but it helps. Um, got one, 2200 PSI. Got off of Amazon for, I don't know, 100 bucks or 80 bucks or something. Um, so you also need a muddy four-wheeler. I got my Sportsman 570. It's not super muddy, as you can see. Um, but it's, you know, it's got a little dirt on it. I don't know how well you can see because of the GoPro on my head, the angle of it's not great. Um, but it's, you know, it's dirty. There's some stuff in there. All right, so you just told me to just do a quick walk around, make sure that, you know, make sure everything's closed. You don't want to be shooting water in anything. Um, I'm not going to cover the electronics in here. Uh, you can if you want to. I'm just going to be careful around that section. So the first thing I'm going to do is just hose it down with normal hose pressure. In theory, that helps you turn on your, your water, which I'm going to do now. Don't forget that. It's an important step. All right, let's try that again. All right. So like anything else, go from the top down. Dirt's gonna go down. Make sure your seat's on all the way, obviously. Got a little friend living in there. Get rid of that with a pressure washer. A lot of times people forget to go underneath there real good. You only gotta kill yourself on the wheels. All right. Same thing here underneath there. You wanna clean the frame off. That's important, because that's what you don't want to rust. So you actually wanna get underneath it too. Oh, wear safety, uh, wear safety glasses. I was just reminded because I got a little wet there. A little wet there too. Put this on. Hand doesn't hurt. Get in there good. Good on that side. Pull out a little more hose. Okay. Again, top down, watch the electronics. That bumper bar clean. Don't want to get too much in the winch. Don't want that rusting out. I do want to get this side of the wheels. side. Try not to bump into my pressure washer. There we go. Again, get that frame real good. Like I said, I'm not gonna kill myself here. 
Just uh, get it decent. So I'm gonna come back and hit it all with a pressure washer. Cause it looks clean now. I know there's a lot of stuff still caked in there. I don't want to get too much water in the exhaust, it can help it. That nasty thing off of there, that thing's gross. Get out of there, spiders. Whatever you are. All right. Okay, then get this off. All right, so now you've knocked the major mud off. Oh, except for that. All right, you got the major mud off. Then you want to hit it with a pressure washer. Let's see if I can do this without getting too terribly wet. Nope, all right. So turn off the water. I got these um, quick connects, which are great. So, all right, so to wash your four-wheeler, you knock off all of the big stuff first. The pressure off the line here. These quick connects are awesome, by the way. I get these off Amazon. And then get it into your pressure washer. Try not to get too tangled if you can help it. Same thing, quick connect. Don't forget to turn the water back on. That's a big mistake, easy enough to do. All right, water back on. Um, I've already filled this reservoir, I'll double check it. Yeah, you can see I filled this reservoir with soapy water. Um, this uh, nozzle here is for the soapy water. So we're gonna get that on there. I got some nasty stuff on this, I don't know what that is. All right, make sure that the hose is on. So it should just spray a good amount of water through it still. All right, pop her on. Nothing happened. Not sure why. No, I got it plugged in. Let me go hit the reset on it. Then, there she goes, all right. So, this is again soapy water. You can kind of see it foaming a little. Doesn't grab a lot of soap. Doesn't get a lot of soap, but it gets enough of it just to put a little bit of something on it. And you can see as it dries, a lot of that dirt that uh, that you thought you got off earlier, still there. So uh, that's why you want to use a pressure washer. Really get it. So um, I don't want to damage it. So I'm going to do the 25 degree nozzle. Should be enough. All right, and then. Same thing, top to bottom.
Okay. Again, wear your safety goggles. Wash will fall over, so I'm gonna move it. Oh, give me a little more cord here. Okay. Same thing, top to bottom. Stretch here.
Gotta keep that clean. a fresh clean four-wheeler take one more walk around I'm gonna let it air dry I'm sure it'll freeze tonight so uh, hopefully that Sun will do its thing for another hour or so I'll put her away all right thanks for watching see ya